by Karnataka Deputy Chief Minister Mr D K Shivakumar he has now said that JDS and the Bharatiya Janata Party MLAs are thinking of bringing down the government together now why has he gone on to make such a statement which is a stinging criticism of the impending alliance between the JDS and BJP he would have to wait and watch but jds has ended up countering the statement of dk shivakumar and it has said the jds and bjp mlas cannot form a government together and they are not trying any operation in singapore so operation singapore rao has escalated as dk shivakumar the deputy chief minister of karnataka has ended up uh, leveling a big allegation over these reports of an impending alliance between jds and bjp which the jds has countered point blank let me take this across to my colleague uh, harish padhya who's joining us on the broadcast harish operation singapore throw light on this and now that there is a counter to the statement that dk shivakumar has made by jds they are ruling out any sort of an alliance with bjp so that's not happening it seems since last week kesri devagoda the former prime minister and the jds supremo has maintained that uh, the regional party would not have uh, alliance with anyone Hmm. either the bjp or the jds he is reiterating the same now especially with dk shukumar's yesterday's allegation that uh, uh, kumar swami who is abroad might in fact be trying to have meetings to ensure that uh, they bring down this congress government with the help of the bjp now the jds has come out and said there's no such proposal one second in fact same abram uh, the state president going forward and saying that uh, the jds and the bjp together have no numbers to come together and uh, yes. bring the, bring down this government so there's no question of alliance no question of destabilizing this government so where did the reports really spring from harish if we talk about operation singapore what really is that what is the background to it and like you rightly said bjp jds combined do not really have the numbers because everybody has seen how unprecedented a victory this was for the congress party in the state of karnataka Mr. Kumar Swamy and his family currently abroad for a vacation, hmm. and uh, that's what triggered this rumor with the uh, DK Shiv Kumar stepping out and saying that perhaps he is in Singapore hmm. uh, to destabilize the government. Uh, this is in a reference to 2018 when DK Shiv uh, when H D Kumar Swamy was abroad during the results, and uh, it is speculated that a lot of negotiation happened there. And uh, once again, DK Shiv Kumar hinting that with H uh, D Kumar Swamy going abroad, uh, it could be a repeat of the scene. Right. Thank you so much for that, Harish. Uh, let me take this across to Mr. S. Prakash of the BJP, who is not joining us on the broadcast. Mr. Prakash, thank you so much for being a part of this conversation. Your first reactions on the statement that has been made by D. K. Shiv Kumar, accusing the BJP and J. D. S. combined of uh, probably attempting to topple the Congress government in Karnataka. Even with hundred and thirty-five MLAs. If the B K Shukuma, being the deputy chief minister, K P C C president, hmm. does not have faith in his own M L A, hmm. it, it, it speaks of sad, sad state of affairs in the Congress party. They should have been confident to take on any kind of challenge from the opposition party. First of all, B J P is not at all interested in toppling this government or destabilizing this government. Mr. D K Shukuma is making a very wild and a fabricated. Charge uh, which his own chief minister is not agreeing. Mr. Sitarama is on record that he is unaware of any such development in the state. So, Mr. D K Shukuma either should produce the evidence for his charges or take back his uh, uh, charges. All right, uh, Mr. S. Prakash, thank you so much for joining us and offering your perspective on this story. Remember, this is a controversial one that's stemming out of Karnataka, and now over these allegations on whether JDS and BJP are going to be joining hands, there is a statement that's come in by the Deputy Chief Minister of uh, Karnataka, Mr. D. K. Shiv Kumar, accusing the impending alliance of probably trying to topple the Congress government in Karnataka. uh my colleague uh, harish also continues to be with us we have our eyes on this story uh, but we will uh, let that be for now and we are slipping into a very very short break we'll coming right back